Have you ever wondered why you prefer to continue maintain your old cast iron simple engine rather than to buy new fancy aluminum with a whole bunch with electronic engine? Patrick's Garage. Grab your snack, welcome back. So let's discuss why we prefer to continue using our old engine and why this best match for us if we have to use this engine. Probably I think this is reliable construction, really economical engine. You want to use a simple mineral-based oil for this old style engine rather than to buy synthetic oil which more really expensive and you can maintain your engine by our hands without any fancy equipment go to dealer station they more reliable all uh, old engine more reliable <laughs> not all <laughs> but old engines more reliable you you know without this electronic and a lot of weakest points in construction you know volvo my old engine of my volvo without interferences but truly say you know when i bought 940 series volvo and uh, you know in junkyard they say to me uh, that uh, this is also without interferences engine but this engine with timing belt but you know volvo 140 series uses uh, b20 b18 engine uh, with timing gears and uh, what i want to say without interferences yes this engines without interferences without this stinky timing belt and what can be worse if we uh, talking about new engine uh, this is really weakest points with oil you know this is idiot lamps when oil drops down you know this is tensioner chain tensioner if your engine with chain uh, with pressure of oil when not enough pressure gears can slide and this can be wrong when valve piston hits the valves what can be goodbye engine you want to rebuild engine this is oil level should be in proper level you want to check your oil level if you have any suspicions that your new engine burns oil load inside piston rings especially with turbo turbo pulls inside the cylinders mixture so yes uh, this is will be better more powerful but <laughs> in papers this powerful and fuel economy also in papers just for clean tail they want to cheating their clean tail and they want to say hey look so beautiful economic car with powerful engine with turbo nothing wrong that this is small gasoline engine with turbo and this engine even under warranty burns oil if it not build it correct correctly in the factory uh, which was with my volkswagen when i worked as a driver you know i remember that i added oil to this engine because the level of oil drops and you are you know this uh, level gradually goes down and when not enough air oil and uh, chain tensioner not works as it should be so chain can slides and what that means piston hits the valves but with old engines you know this is timing gears 
uh, Volvo uses timing gears yes uh, fiberglass made out of fiberglass this is timing gears nothing wrong because they will be noisy if they made out them from steel from aluminum they this uh, move was done for quietness of engine yes if you really insane you can install you not afraid of this horrible noise you can install steel gears which they're using for military engines and by the way this engine was used in military with all these protective covers for uh, for ignition system protective covers from impulses you know from nuclear this was protected down and yes you know guys they can selling this engine i don't know where they are able to find this military engine which was used in sweden in the 60s but from storage probably i don't know but thing is if we say that this is old engines more reliable this is really true not just because we have to use we more familiar with this engine they more simple ignition more simple fuel system more simple it not related with computer when computer wrong computer never going to admit never going to admit that computer wrong oh no nothing wrong with me even if you want to making this scanning you go to mechanic for scanning all your computer not uh, computer never going to say that it's wrong so more better more reliable to use engine without this is I think this is not needless. A lot of electronic, yes, performance more better with modern engine, but reliability with if you want to save your engine forever, because this is simple engine. Now, hardly they are able to represent really reliable engine without any weakest point even today. And how far are they going to stretch with complex electronic with engine? Yes, more prominent cars in the road. Yes, this is really big Toyotas. They are reliable. But if we talking about subcompact car, this not so reliable as they used to be. We want to admit. This endeavor to create a really economical car just finished with unreliability. So if you think that new engine means good, you're sorely mistaken. And all this to say old engine no worse than new. Yes, this is hilarious, but in our day, old car is considered just as substantial as a new car. No less interest among car enthusiasts to old cars, old engines. Because they are reliable since you rebuild your engine. By the way, this is a really lucrative job to rebuild the engines. And are you sure that your old engine has been going on for years without any problems? Another question, have you found this process of hiring mechanics more better to accomplish all these things by our own hands if this is simple engine? Another thing if engine worn, yes, in uh, this comparison, <laughs> new engine more better, but also with the weakest points. But in old engine <laughs> more, you can counting more uh, warnest uh, things. So old engine just worn. But we can't blame this engine because 
in construction is more reliable. So if you have old engine, get excited because you are able to rebuild it. And you're on the right path. This is more better than go to deep debts to buy new some subcompact car. <laughs> and we are really resilient by the circumstances that we able to rebuild our car by our own hands. But let's be honest, which engines are performing best? Yes, of course, answer obvious, modern engines. But a lot of strengths you can find in old construction of engine. That's because I continue maintain my old car and I'm going to continue this process of repairing restoration. And I'm really interesting what you like about your old car, your old engine. I'm really interesting. If you want, you can share with me your thoughts. So if you have old engine, this is really great. And once you pin that down, you're able to maintain and rebuild. Just consider this for a moment. You don't want to spend your money for this repair process of simple things which you are able to repair by oven hands. <laughs> yes, I want to confess I tried to continue this process uh, several times over. Yes, we always hope in traditional sense new means good. But as time and experience shows that old cars, old engines, more reliable. <laughs> Strange, of course, but it's nonetheless. Now, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do. Click the subscribe button and notifications bell, so that way you can be notified as soon as I upload new videos about car repairing.